Hello, it's Theo from Theo's Tech Tips, and in this video I'm going to show you how to run Windows apps and games on an M1 Mac. Let's get started. And the first thing we're going to do is to open up a web browser, and we're going to go to the Whiskey website, and we're going to go to the Download Latest button. And we also need a program to run, so I'm going to demo this using Steam. So we're just going to go to the Steam website and download the exe. So now we need to go open up the whiskey file, and we're going to drag it into the Applications folder. And now we're going to go ahead and open up whiskey, and we're going to click on Next, and it's going to download the version of Wine for us. So once it's done that, you should see an interface that looks something like this. So now we're going to go and click on Create Bottle, and we're going to call it Steam. We're going to set the Windows version and the path. We're going to click on Create. And a bottle is the environment that the Windows apps run in. So now we're going to go down to Run, and we're going to choose our exe file. We're going to click on Next, and choose our language, Install, and we're going to uncheck the Run Steam button so it doesn't run automatically. And then we're going to click on Finish. And now that Steam is installed, you should see a little icon over here. So now we're going to right click on it, and we're going to click on Config, and we're going to go down to the Create Shortcut button, and we're going to give it a name and save it somewhere. So I'm going to save it to my Applications folder, and we're going to click on Save, and here it is. So now we can just double click on Steam, and this is going to run the Windows version of Steam. We should be greeted with the Steam login page. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. I'm Theo from Theo's Tech Tips, and I'll see you next time. Bye!